The Edgar Winter Group and Frankenstein, Southern Utah's Classic Rock 95.9. The Hawk Murphy and Clutch hanging with you on the Rock and Roll Morning Show. Good morning, man. It's 8.30 straight up. And, uh, man, do I have a treat for you guys today. Oh, indeed we do. Yeah. Now, I don't know if you're uh, familiar with Maxim Magazine, but uh, I subscribe to it. And uh, it not only does it give me great show preparation, uh, it's full of uh, scantily clad. Great women. joy. Yes, indeed. Uh, but uh, what they do every year, they have a uh, hometown hotties uh, where girls, uh, you know, the girl next door, man, you know, they just uh, sit, get to submit their pictures and uh, it goes to a vote and uh, they name uh, the nationwide hometown hottie. Well, uh, we a very beautiful young woman here uh, from St. George has entered that contest and she graces us with her presence right now on the radio. Michelle O'Connor, how are you? Good. Thank you for having me. Uh, very excited to have you in the studio. Uh, obviously, big fan of your work. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. And, uh, Thank you, you. You can actually check out her spread. Uh, you might want to. Why is that doing that? I have no idea. She's like, she's like way over loud. Uh, check her spread out. We have a post on our Facebook page. Go to nine five nine the hawk. Oh no, I'm sorry. You go to facebook.com slash nine five nine kzhk. Yeah. And you can see Michelle uh, in full detail. Uh, nice bikini spread that you got. Is that uh, what did they ask you for when you were auditioning for this? I mean, what what pictures do they they say? They didn't really. Specify at all, but I had just done a bikini photo shoot, and mm-hmm. so I'm just like, might as well just post these up there. And so, <laughs> how about these? They're apparently working, so. <laughs> and uh, now you have made it past the first round. I have not made it past the first round yet. This is what this this week is oh, for, okay. and so this okay. is all the voting, and this is actually what leads into the semifinals. So if I can get past this round, then yes, I'm halfway there. Uh, I got kind of caught up on your bio. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, and uh, we just, <laughs> just want to uh, premise that she's local. So, Dad, uh, she is being she's being treated with much respect here in the studio. But we are going to go through the, the, the bio. Uh, were you encouraged to make a spicier bio? They didn't really specify for that either. They're just like, here, here's some questions. Answer them. And I'm pretty usually blunt and honest with my answers anyway. So... And I didn't think it was going to get this much attention, but it did. And now I'm just like, oh, okay, this is a little embarrassing, but it's all right. It's all right. It's all right. Dad, the president already knew your answers. So <laughs> Yeah, that's good. right. Yeah. It's, it's all good. Everybody knows anyway. Yeah. So. And we are, we are looking through your bio here. And uh, boy, uh, your, your movie theater story. Love it. <laughs> oh, my God. You, you kind of reversed the roles a little bit. And I'm not going to go into detail here. Yeah, you uh, can. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Okay, but, but I don't know exactly how you can say it, but uh, logi- check out her. logistically in a movie theater, you know, you always hear it the other way around. You do. Was it accommodating for that kind of a thing? You know, it worked at the time. We were the only ones in there, <laughs> and so I was a little worried, but I'm just like, wow. what the hell? Let's do this. So. Yeah. Wow. Geez. Yeah. And uh, yeah, that. Uh, that's 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 awesome. I I, 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 I gotta compared, be tough I, on the dude, I, I could, man. <laughs> <laughs> very he worked it out. Props yeah. to him, you know. Props to Should've him, right around. on. And he's an ex now. <laughs> he is. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Didn't do it well enough, dude. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. Uh, but yeah, man, you can check out our uh, Facebook page, nine five nine KZHK, and uh, you know I've posted it a couple times, and that will have the link there, and you can go. You can vote once per day. And now, when does the voting cut off? The voting for this week cuts off Sunday at midnight, mm-hmm. and I don't know when the semifinals will start and end because they'll have to get the emails out. They probably want me to submit more pictures if I get that far, but so would this we. week and Sunday at midnight. Oh. And uh, do we get to see more pictures? Are you going to be posting? Are you gonna, do you have a page or anything? I where... do have a Facebook page. Okay. And um, if you want that link, it's like Facebook slash Loverface Michelle. Love. But, oh, cool. <laughs> yeah. Um... But other than that, I post pictures all the time, and there will be more to come if I get in there. Okay. Hopefully, I do. Fingers crossed. Uh, okay, so uh, being beautiful. Curse, or has it helped? All right. Well, I haven't always seen myself as beautiful. I've gone through a lot in the last two years. So my photographer, this um, the shoot she did for me really boosted my my ego. She is Desiree with Best Photography. Okay. And so she's the one that actually pushed me to do it. And I'm glad I did. And it's been, it feels like more of a curse lately because mm-hmm. I have had the worst anxiety this week. But I'm sure this isn't helping any. It, <laughs> it kind of feels good, though, you know, like yeah. to get the attention. So. Yeah, I, oh, you know, absolutely. I'm glad that your your friend, um, I, I Desiree. Desiree. Uh, there you go. Okay, yeah. 
Wow. Yeah, she, she, she's then. the one that uh, initially yeah. reached out to Jeez, us and uh, let us know. asking you. I'm sorry about hey, that. No, she, no. Does, <laughs> she does a beautiful job. Your photos are spectacular. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. I'm glad she Thank reached you. out to us and said, hey, you know, go check this out. So that gave us the, because uh, I wouldn't have known, you know. I mean, uh, as much as I like to look at scantily clad women <laughs> online, you know, I'm not going to go through thousands of them and find out that there's one from actually from St. George. I so would. it would <laughs> Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, but, so, uh, so, so, so here's your moment, okay? We, uh, you know, you got to get ready for this. You, you're possibly going to be getting in the pages of Maxim Magazine. Possibly going to have a lot of people focused in on you. You might have your stage moment. So you ready? I, I will be ready. I will get there. Okay, I want to give you a question. Okay. You ready? Um, I'm ready as hell. All right, here we go. A recent report shows that in 40% of American families with children, women are the primary earners, yet they continue to earn less than men. What does this say about society? Um, they need to pay women more. I mean, like, women should be the breadwinners. We're, <laughs> we are smarter. We're attractive. Ah, Come on. Nice. <laughs> Come on. Very good. Yeah. I, I just gave What's you, wrong with society? I just gave you the question that flubbed up Mrs. Utah on the patch, and I think you just kicked its ass. Yeah, I tried to look at that last night, but I couldn't sit through it. So. Oh, man. <laughs> it made my brain hurt. I was like, oh, create education better? What the hell are you talking about? Uh, what do right. you mean? <laughs> Well, Jeez. we've got uh, Michelle Connor in the studio, and uh, we're going to be talking to her. We could uh, probably take a break and uh, come right back with more of potential Maxim Centerfold, right? Or are you looking for front cover? I'm, uh, it doesn't matter. Give, either way, give either me either. it all. <laughs> give me it all. Thank we'll, you. We'll be right back with Michelle at 95.9 The Hawk. Southern Utah's Classic Rock, 95.9 The Hawk. Live and let die. Uh, the Rock and Roll Morning Show. Uh, Murphy and Clutch here hanging with you on your hump day. It's 845 Good morning. Good I morning like, to you, Murphy. I like this uh, music, man. I haven't seen you this happy in a while. What's oh, new? Man, I'll tell you what's new is that uh, I'm sitting currently with uh, a hometown hottie uh, in contention for uh, winning that title of Maxim Magazine. Um, yeah. The ha- stunning Michelle O'Connor sitting in with us. Thank you so much for uh, classing up the joint. No, thank you. This is an honor for me to be here. Yeah, we, we are certainly enjoying it. Uh, the, the likes are uh, going out of control on the Facebook page for uh, our little article about you, and uh, that's great. Thank mm-hmm. you. And Thank uh, you. so, so what? What do you want to tell people? How can they help you uh, represent St. George as hometown hottie on Max Magazine? Basically, just getting the word out is the most help that you could give me. Just share that link that is on the page. Share it to all your friends. Ask them to vote. Ask them to share, and just so I could get out there and get as many votes as I can, that helps completely. And I was kind of flipping through. <laughs> you know, the nice thing about you know being in radio, you know, I I don't know how uh, liberal some jobs are about surfing on the internet, but I'm just like flipping through hotties. They don't hold a oh yeah. I'm, I'm waiting for our IT department to come, to come up to me and what? Why were you looking at this? <laughs> Show prep, man. Yeah, that's it's all, all it is. show prep. It's all show prep. But yeah, the uh, pictures don't do it justice. You really are stunning. Thank you. And uh, and uh, although your photographer did a fantastic job, uh, you can see some sand hollow photos in there as well, and uh, uh, just uh, some amazing photography. And hopefully that gets you over the top. I would love. I mean, how ironic, you know, to have a Maxim hometown hottie yeah, out of right? St. George, Utah. No <laughs> kidding, man. Yeah. So you can go to our Facebook page, facebookcom slash 959kzhk and uh, I've posted the link there a couple times, so uh, you can vote once per day. The voting ends when? It ends Sunday at midnight. Okay. So, uh, everybody, I encourage you, definitely, man, how how awesome would that be to have uh, somebody represent our, you know, uh, people think that, uh, you know, that it's not a rock and roll town. They don't think that... Uh, I don't know how Utah did not make the B, uh, the uh, David Lee Roth uh, Van Halen song. Uh, oh. the California girls. Utah girls are fantastic. Dude, I, I worked for eight years as a stagehand. Uh, you know, working uh, all over the place, Nevada, Utah. And uh, one of the questions I would always ask uh, uh, would be, you know, where, what do you like most about Utah, coming to Salt Lake mm-hmm. or wherever the, the area that I was working at the time? And the majority of all the roadies that I've ever interviewed, going from roadies working from Ted Nugent to ZZ Top to Avenged Sevenfold to, uh, I've, you know, I've worked for many, many people. Anyway, it was always Utah has the most beautiful women. No exception in studio. Once again, thank you, Michelle O'Connor, for coming in. You are a joy. And you answered the question that Miss Utah loved perfectly. Yeah, perfectly, man. Nicely done. <laughs> right on. Yeah, go to our Facebook page, facebook.com slash 959KZHK. Click on that link there. That'll send you to the Maxim page. 
where you can vote for her up until Sunday. Thanks again for coming Thank in. Thank you. Do you want to say so hi? Much. You want to say hi to anybody while you're? You know, I you want to say hi to everyone out there. So <laughs> many people are helping me, and I appreciate it so much. They probably think I'm so buggy though because I'm just harassing them to vote and share. So uh, I'm sorry, but thank you. <laughs> we'll have you back anytime. You just come on back. Yeah, we'll just come and hang out. Yeah, I'll just come and hang out. Yeah, you're you're hang going. Out. You're going person to person. We got the power right here. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> right on. Thanks again. Go vote, man. Southern Utah's classic rock. 95.9 The Hawk.